Welcome to Catatouille. I'm your host, Jasani Jackson. This week, we'll be making loaded baked potato soup and turkey sliders. First, we're gonna start off by making the loaded baked potato soup. Before we start, this is what you'll need. One small onion, two cloves of garlic, five to six large potatoes, two cups of chicken broth, three-fourths cup of butter, three-fourths cup of all-purpose flour, one cup of heavy whipping cream, five cups of whole milk, half a teaspoon of salt, half a teaspoon of pepper, two cups of shredded cheese, one bunch of green onions, and half a cup of sour cream. To start, we're gonna use a fork, poke holes in the potatoes, then we're gonna put them in a the microwave for eight to 10 minutes or until they're tender. Once the potatoes are tender, we're going to allow them to cool and then begin to remove the skin and cut them into one inch cubes. Now we're going to melt the butter in a large pot over medium-low heat. Once the butter is melted, we're going to add in the onions, garlic, potatoes, and cook slightly. So when it says um, cook slightly, you just want to cook it a little bit because you're going to have to continue cooking it with all the milk and everything. So you don't want to overcook it and then it's mushy and gross at the end. Next, we're going to whisk in the flour, salt, and pepper and continue to stir for two more minutes. We're going to continue to stir while adding in our chicken broth, milk, and heavy whipping cream until everything is smooth. Now that the mixture is boiling, we're going to turn down the heat and allow it to simmer for an additional five minutes. While this is simmering, we're going to take a commercial break and when we get back, we're going to finish our soup and then start on our turkey sliders. Welcome back Katatouille fans. Now that our soup has been simmering for five minutes, we're going to add in our cheese, green onions, and sour cream. And you're just gonna make sure that you get everything mixed in there all evenly. Your cheese is nice and melted, sour cream spread all the way out. Just make sure that everything is touching everything. <laughs> now that our soup is done, we're gonna take it, set it aside, and start on our turkey sliders. Here's what you need for the turkey sliders. One pack of Hawaiian rolls, three fourths a cup of honey mustard, four tablespoons of butter, half a cup of mayonnaise, nine ounces of smoked turkey, and six slices of Swiss cheese. First, we're gonna preheat our oven to 350 degrees so that it's nice and warm when we put our sliders inside. 
Now that our oven is heating, we're going to cut our Hawaiian rolls in half and place the bottom half inside of our 9 by 13 pan. Next, we're going to add mustard to the bottom half of the rolls, and then we're going to add mayonnaise to the top half. Now that the mustard and mayonnaise are on the rolls, we're going to add our turkey and our cheese. Finally, we're going to add our top layer of rolls, completing our sliders. Before putting our sliders in the oven, we're going to pour melted butter onto the rolls evenly. Now that the butter is on the sliders, we're going to place them in the oven, allow them to cook for five to 10 minutes or until the cheese is melted. When we get back, we're gonna take our sliders out of the oven and taste our dish. Stay tuned on KNWT Channel 8. Welcome back. Now that our sliders have been cooking for five minutes, it's time to take them out the oven. Now that both dishes are done, it's time to make our plate. Now that we got everything plated up and it's smelling good, we're gonna bring out one of our Katatui crew members to taste our food. Here comes Nate. I'm too big, so I'm gonna get on your level. On oh, my level? Yeah. Wow. Okay, so we have our loaded baked potato soup and our turkey sliders. You ready? Yeah, which are you starting with? Probably the slider. All right, I'm gonna start with slider too. Oh no. There's just a little bit of honey mustard on there that gives it a little bit of sweetness that's really good and is really crunchy, which I like. It tastes almost like um, a panini. Yeah. I just love the butter. Hawaiian rolls are good by itself. So it's just, I just, it's making me happy. You ready to try <laughs> yeah. some of this soup? That is really, really rich. It is. You can like, taste like the sour cream. You also taste like the heavy whipping cream that we use. Oh, you can taste everything. The potatoes, like, it's good, but it's that, very rich. That's half a cup. Like, that's not, <laughs> that's not a whole cup of soup meal right there. I like it though. I mean, I honestly, I'm gonna probably eat some more. Okay, let's rate it um, on a scale of one to 10, rate the sliders. Um, for sliders, I'm going to give it a 9 out of 10. I'm going to give it a 10 out of 10. It was that good to me. What about the soup? Uh, I'm going to give the soup a 7 out of 10 just because I don't think I'd be able to eat a whole bowl of it. Yeah, I, I agree. I think it's 7 out of 10. I think I'm, I don't know. It's just, it's a little too rich for me, but I, it's still pretty good. Like, you can taste everything. Yeah. That's it for this week's show of Katatui. Be sure to check us out on Instagram, Twitter, Facebook, and KNWT Channel 8. Click here for the latest episode of Amazing Things, and click here for the latest episode of Gen 2.